Right. What, what what is this about Richard? Let's do this. All right. Jill, you remember where to go, right? I mean, we we need to get to Richard as soon as possible. ASAP. ASAP. <coughs> I think Richard's through here. Jill, you better be right. Richard doesn't live long. Richard, we have the serum. Richard, hold on. Yes. You're shot now. I apparently picked up a syringe. Oh. Oh my goodness. No. Richard. Is a poor soul. Richard is dead. Oh, we can't pick ammo off of him. Oh, come on, Jill. Be nice. What did he give us? He gave us absolutely nothing. Oh, stupid Richard. Hate Richard now. It's a good thing Jill took her time. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! What did you do? Get back up! Get back up! <sighs> okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest there. That 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 kind of startled me. I didn't expect that zombie there. I expectedly didn't expect him to spit bile at me. <laughs> yeah, much, much less that. Um, there's obviously something in this room. There gotta be something in this room. It's more clips! More clips! D do we really need... Well, we, we can push this door. Hey, look! A door! Hey, look! Something! Hey, it's too dark to see. Oh, I know what to do. We got a lighter. Candle. How about we light the candle? <clears throat> and now, we can see what's in here. It's got some uh, acid rounds. It's nice. Is th Was there any point to that room other than to give you ammo? Did I waste all this for nothing? Is Barry Burden anywhere in this house? I've checked everywhere. It's 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 locked. Oh you <coughs> resisting the urge to scream. I'm resisting the urge to scream. Still Richard. Still didn't bring any ammo with you. No wonder you died. <sighs> Got some space. We can take one of these. We're going back to the save room, so drop it off. <clears throat> I am resisting the urge to totally go out and kill everything. It's alright, it's okay, it's alright. Hmm. No, no, we gotta go back to that save room first and drop everything off. <coughs> right. This is the part of the game that gets a little tedious because you have, like, all sorts of stuff but nowhere to put it. Because Jill can't keep clips on her belt. She has to put it in her backpack. She doesn't even have a backpack. What am I talking about? Does she have a backpack? Do you see a backpack? I don't see a backpack. How is she keeping all this? Where is she putting it all? Not in her shirt, I hope. That's a very crowded shirt, Jill. If so. I mean, she can't put it in her pockets. She doesn't have a backpack. Someone tell me where she's putting it all. 
stupid grenade rounds. We don't need these. We don't need more green herbs. We've got plenty. I don't think we need the lighter. Lighter is useless now. It's gonna bite me back in the butt. <laughs> oh, right. Okay, now... We can go around. And go... Back upstairs, back through the hallway, back over there. Back everywhere. We're just going backwards. Backwards of phobia. Where? Jill, Jill, stop running in the stairs. Uh, alright. Go over here. I really ain't got much to talk about because this is just a lot of backtracking. Because I'm an idiot, I don't put items where they're supposed to go. It's even worse on Chris's scenario because he only has like four item slots, I think. No, oh, hold on, let me count. One, two, 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 three. He only has six item slots. So it's even more of a nightmare <coughs> with Chris, which is why I dr which is why I'm gonna dread doing it if people ask me. I'm gonna be like, do I have to do Chris? He has so little items. I could care less if Jill has less health. She has more item spaces. That's what keeps me coming back to Jill's scenario. She has more items. Oh, don't. Oh, I got a radio. Um...